Good morning, good morning. Happy Monday, everybody. Hello, Miel Fox, Northern Vermont, sitting in the parking lot at work. You can see I'm a little bushy-eyed this morning. Man, I just cannot get me enough sleep right now. Uh, those of us here in our little neighborhood, we got some snow coming, so I'm dressed and I'm ready for it. But before I do that, I wanted to do our morning alphabet soup bowl of you, building a bowl of you. So, as you guys know, I love coming on here, and uh, this time of year I go through the alphabet, and I call it alphabet soup, and we choose words beginning with certain letters and why they're important. So, we're on the letter M. If you scroll back through the timeline, you're going to see all the other letters. You're welcome to jump on. So, we're on the letter M, and I saved this from last Thursday to today for Monday because I wanted very much to do the letter M on Monday. Hi, Keisha. How are you? Gina, how are you? So, uh, I'll just give you my quickie weekend. Those of you, the horse gals that are on here, I had to put my trailer up for the season. I know, that's very sad for me. It's kind of like, uh, that's like the door is closed for the season, you know what I'm saying? And I'm pulling shoes this week, so I'm like, oh, boo-hoo. So, anyway, hey, Em, how you doing? Good morning. Uh, so, so that's a scoop in horse land, yeah. So, tis that season. Let's talk M, okay? M for Monday, first of all. Happy Monday, everybody. Happy Veterans Day, everybody. I want to say thank you so much to our veterans, past, current, and future, for your service to our country, for maintaining our freedoms. We are, are so very blessed and grateful to, to have people who are willing to fight for our freedom. So I thank all of our veterans for your service very, very much. Um, Monday, interesting. Some of us are open. Some of us are closed. Federal government things are all closed. I work in healthcare. Uh, we're open. So, okay, that's that's good. That's very helpful. It helps people. So let's get on to the words for M, okay? The the two main words I want to talk about today, three main words, and I'll make it really quick because I only have like less than 10 minutes to get it done. Um, first of all, one, you know, mindset. I am like, you know, the mindset mentor girl. I mean, that's me. Inspirational diva, mindset mentor girl. I have this thing about mindset and how can we help people improve their mindset and be mindful so that they can enjoy their lives and gain their dreams and their visions. And so that's part of what Alphabet Soup is, is to really just, just you know, make you think a little bit. Like, hmm, what does it really mean in my world? Okay, so mindset is one of my M words. What you put in your mind, how you choose to lead your life every day, those little tiny choices make a difference in the big picture. We don't think about the little choice like it matters, but Stark, Stark, Start stacking those little choices, one on top of the other, and the next thing you know, you've built into something else. It happens in everything you do in your world. As simple as, like, do you decide on one cookie or 20 cookies? Do you decide on, you know, one beverage or multiple beverages? Good morning, Carol. How are you? Do you, you know, the, the little choices about what do you do for me, for example, with my horses? If I'm not consistent every day and I make a tweak and a change and I'm not consistent with that and I continue to compile those inconsistencies by those choices I make daily, the next thing you know, you got a wreck on your hands. So the bottom line is small decisions, little choices in the moment add up, ripple effect, and move forward into impacting which way does your life go? How does your journey go? How how great is your journey or how not great is your journey? It's a mind gig, okay? It's all up here. It's about what do you decide? How do you decide? What is your... You know, is your palette painted in poopoo or is your palette painted in beautiful colors? That is totally, totally up to you. And again, that's all about mindset and mindfulness. So that's one of our M, word, M, M words for today. No, that was a V. M word for today. All right. The second M word that this, this word is going to go on for a while because I'm actually going to take this word and expand it for the next two months in on the business page and get ready for this people because this is a biggie money all right everybody has hang-ups about money because they attach emotional things to money what does it mean what does it represent how does it control their life or not control their life and here is the deal yes we need money not because money has in itself some amazing thing but because it serves as a means of exchange of goods and services for a currency. The problem is, is that we connect emotional crap to money, which is how we get into that whole cycle of, do I not have enough? Do I have too much? How do I make it? What do I do with it? Oh, I really need it. No, I don't really want it. Oh, I've always been told it's not good. It's dirty to talk about it. It's this, it's that, whatever. We are going to dig into that a little bit more on the other page because especially at this time of year going into the holidays, oh, it's a biggie. It's a biggie. 
because it starts to get wrapped around with things like, do I need to keep up with the Joneses? Uh, you know, how much is enough? Is, is the gift that I give to my neighbor okay or not okay? You know, what does it represent? So it's not really the money itself. You know, it's not the bill in your hand, the quarter, the nickel, the whatever. It's not really that. It's what it represents and how do we attach what we think about it to what it represents. So we're going to go into that because that's kind of a biggie, especially at this time of year. So anywho, Alphabet Soup, that's it for Monday. Happy Veterans Day. Happy Monday to everybody. Um, what else? What else? Tomorrow, if I can manage it in the snowstorm, we'll get on and talk about the letter N. So it depends on how naughty the snowstorm is. But, you know, be safe on the roads. And there you are, Alphabet Soup, building a bowl of you for Monday. So have a great day, everybody. Thanks for jumping on. Appreciate it. And I'll see you guys soon. Be safe on the roads.